Okay, everyone, this is a, uh, a land yacht. I don't know the year or the length of it right now. Um, real quick, though, we are going to pull some dents out of it. As you can see, there's a pretty big one right there. Pretty big one right there. We've got a massive one over there. Um, you could definitely see that one. Um, we're going to try and do it with PDR set, and we'll see how far we get. I'll show you guys how, how this goes. Right now, Paul here is going to uh, clean this back dent real quick. It's just rubbing alcohol. It's going to get all the dirt off. Definitely got to make sure it's clean to get a good, uh, good adhesion with the... Uh... Is that a dent right there? No. Okay. Let's just, let's just work on those, what we found. So, the first thing you got to do is beside, after you clean the dents is find a tab. You want to go with the biggest tab size you have. To fit that dent. Yeah, to fit the dent. You don't really want to be starting out with a smaller tab because then you're going you're gonna to make more problems than you're fixing. So. so, for example, this is a long dent and pretty thin on this side. So we have the oval shape that, as you can see, fills the dent pretty well. So, so you can either do that or you can do two dents, two tabs, two tabs and that's probably what we're going to end up doing there. But he's, we're going to go ahead and put some hot glue on the tabs, and then you just push them on. So, okay. Right, so what uh, Paul's done here is we've cleaned each one of these out, found the tab that best fits the uh, the problem. Apply just a general amount of glue. Don't do a ton of glue because what you need is the glue just to bond to this into the metal. The hole. You push it down hard and firm as soon as you put the glue on and then you just let it sit there and it's usually you know it's a good minute to uh, to five minutes before you want to start pulling. This is pretty thick so we're gonna have to let it sit there for a little while probably closer on the eight minute side. Um, just want to let you all know though we're not professionals this is uh we're amateurs and hobbyists we just rather do it ourselves and you know learn some new skills so well, we're going to go ahead and let this stuff cure, and then uh, we'll show you a video of us trying to pull it out. All right, the uh, tabs are set, so we've got the side hammer. And we're going to give it a few good pulls and see what happens. Now, the trick is not to go hard. You just want lightly manipulate the metal. Actually, it's working. And then you pop it out. Now that's a little, a little convex now, but there's no more dent. That'll fix that. So when he's gonna hit this with some rubbing alcohol, when he pulls that off, you know, it's not, it's usually not a one tab, you're done kind of deal. You might have to pull at it a couple of times. Sometimes you pull too far, and you've got a little hammer, you can pound it back in. You know, this isn't 100% dent removal. It's just 99% without having to do any body work. You just use your fingers, the rubbing alcohol takes the glue right off. And I'm sure we can edit in a before and after. And you can see now that the dent has been pulled, and a slight hammer tap with a flat hammer will push that right back in. Yeah, that's just a little high spot right there, and we've got a hammer to tap. Just like this, a little aluminum hammer. That's good. Go ahead and start pulling on the other ones. We'll come back and clean that up. See, that one didn't set and dry hard enough. So, that's the game you play. Now we'll try these double ones. So he's just going to gently pull on one and get part of the dent up, and then he'll switch to the upper one. There it is. Yeah, see it kind of popped out right there. Wow. Don't pull it too hard. If nothing else, take them off. I think that's it with that. Yeah, hit it with the hit it with the spray, and we'll we'll take a look at that dent and see how it looks.
little, you can see a little right there. Yeah, you might have to go down a down a size though, because you did get most of it. Because that's even right there. That's a little high spot. Well, I'd rather have a high spot than get high spots you can push back in. More rubbing alcohol. Yeah. We got to the part where the glue is sticking. That wavy adhesive. Yeah. So there's definitely still a little bit of a dent right here, but you know most of that's 90% done. So we'll just let the rubbing alcohol dry off of that. Glue another tab in there. A bit two. smaller. One two tabs. And one there. And we'll go from there. So now we'll work on the back ones. Yeah. Now we got to be real gentle with. I think you probably got it. No, because I can still see. You can see how it's still. Let's see. I don't think that one's done. I don't know. You can just pop it off and try it with the glue. So you can see, just put a little bit of glue. You don't need a lot. You don't even fill the whole tab up. Yeah. It just kind of Set presses it, it down, pushes it a little firmly, and then back off. And you have to let the tab sit. That's half of this is just letting the glue dry. It's all the glue I put on. The middle of the dent. Push down and I pull back so that the glue kind of pulls into that dent hole. Because if you push all the way down, it spreads the glue out from the dent. And you really want it based in that hole that you're trying to pull out. Alright, you're going to have to find a really small one probably. One of the little hell ones. 